Now I'm going to talk about our recently published paper, The Bright Side of Social Cheaters, Potential Beneficial Roles of Social Cheaters in Microbial Communities. The phenomenon of social cheating is well known in bacterial populations and in micropopulations, and this happens when uh, there is a cooperative behavior, for example, the production of public goods like cider or course of exoproteins by some of the members of the, of the community. And however, there are other members that uh, sometimes they don't produce uh, these products but enjoy the benefits and they, these are the social cheaters and they, if they accumulate, they may lead to a decrease in the population growth and even to a, a population collapse that is also known as a tragedy of the commons. However, there are many examples that we review in this paper in the literature indicated that at least a moderate amount of these uh, social cheaters can be beneficial. For example, uh, microbial communities are, are sometimes very complex and some individuals uh, that do not cooperate for the production of one uh, cooperative behavior or try uh, cooperate for another one. And hence, they are not, they are not so true social cheaters. Another example is the optimization of resources. This happens with, when the production of the cooperative behavior is very costly and is produced in an excess. Hence, decreasing its production with the social cheatings uh, present in the community uh, may redirect the useful resources and energy for the generation of more, more biomass and then make a more robust uh, community. Another example is the protection against stress. It's well known in some bacteria like Salmonas aeruginosa that social cheaters uh, are also sensitive to stress. Then uh, if a stress comes to the population, they may die preferentially and will release some uh, important nutrients or metabolites like extracellular DNA that may protect the population, for example, enhancing biofilm formation. Another beneficial role is the modulation of viral insulin infection that will allow the population of the bacteria or other microbe to, became, uh, to achieve a chronic infection by decreasing the response of the immune system against. And finally, another example is the coexistence with other bacterial species that is, is also uh, was known for Pseudomonas that in the presence of Pseudomonas cheaters, it allow another uh, bacteria like Cordelia uh, to uh, persist in the, in the same community, making a more diverse community. Thank you very much.